and so here we are um, trip monitors big ass curved screen um, 39 inch dome to what I have now which is a 60 inch dome um, 60 inches wide by 28 inches high this time I went with uh, a P45 acrylic P45 acrylic is like a frosted acrylic the same finish you would see on a, on a shower door um, the concept was was that with with this um, frosted acrylic you should be able to shoot an image on the front and get a good image on the back um, unfortunately as you can see it didn't quite turn out like that um, the image was was crap um, huge hot spot that you'll see it looks like um, looks like the sun's exploding um, right there look at that sun um, it really did not work I was totally gutted over this one um, I did a lot of homework on it I really thought it would work but no no way just just didn't work out I was pretty much lost on uh, what I was going to do so I contacted the guys up at Goo Systems, Goo Paint up in Canada and they so kindly sent me down some Goo rear projection screen paint which I had on the, the first dome that you'll see um, in my early videos and uh, what you'll see now I guess is the you know what happened after I sprayed it with Goo night and day and I only used a probably 200 mil of the thousand mil that they sent me a very light coat of goo and it works it works like a dream
Here we have a couple of still shots to finish. Um, that's kind of before and after I use the goo paint and back again. Uh, just to give you an idea of how good this stuff is. It really does work very, very well. Um, stay tuned next week. I'm going to try and get up some FSX shots, um, some first person shooter, maybe some more driving stuff. Um, I'm also add some video from uh, from somewhere to see if it works with film. Anyway, that's it. Shoot me an email. Leave a message on uh, YouTube if you got any questions. All right, keep watching.